parades. I know you guys will be at the parade this weekend. Mm -hmm. There's so many fun things happening all throughout the Piedmont Triad. And also what's cool about this weekend is an opportunity that we can all give back. So even if it's just the spare change laying around in your pockets, your car, your house, you know what I mean? No it all can be donated. So Samaritan Ministries 28th Annual Penny Campaign is back tomorrow morning at Truist Stadium in Winston-Salem. And to tell us all about it this morning, we'd like to welcome Jan Kelly. She's the executive director of Samaritan Ministries. Jan, good morning. Great to have you here. Good morning. Thanks so much for having me. Oh, you're very welcome. So let's first begin with what sort of programs does the Penny Campaign help support? Well, our mission at Samaritan Ministries is providing food, shelter, and hope through Christian love. We have three programs at the ministry, a soup kitchen that's open for anyone in need 365 days a year, a homeless shelter for men, and also a recovery program for homeless men. So all the money collected will go towards those programs right here in our community. Wow, every single penny. And Jan, tell me what sort of difference you have seen in the past that this penny campaign helps make in our community. Well, I think the most important thing is that we have so many people coming to the soup kitchen each day to eat. We serve about 200 meals in the soup kitchen each day. And those people are not necessarily homeless. At least half of them are not homeless. They're people that have jobs, have a place to live, but they're having struggles making ends meet. So um, getting a free hot meal at the soup kitchen helps them you know, pay for their medication or pay for their rent or even pay for gas in their car. Wow, and Jan, you see that firsthand. I think sometimes it can kind of go underneath the rug if in our day-to-day -day lives we don't actually see the faces behind the need. Would you agree? Yes, I think so. It's easy for us to get caught up in the hustle and bustle, even, you know, of this holiday season with shopping and all of that. But there really are people in our community who struggle. And by giving to the Penny Campaign, you can really give hope to those people. And other ways that we can all help support Samaritan's Ministry if we can't make it to the drive through event tomorrow? Absolutely. We need volunteers 365 days a year. It's really easy to get involved at Samaritan. There's a volunteer link on our website and we'd love for people to help out. You know, maybe that can be a New Year's resolution to join a soup kitchen team at Samaritan Ministries. Great, so volunteers. Now that means that you would you know, choose a time slot, choose a time of the day, and you would go actually to the kitchen face to face and help out. Yes, we okay. have volunteers that come each morning about nine o'clock and uh, help prepare the food for the day and then help get it packaged up. We're doing to-go meals right now because of COVID, uh, but volunteers are really helpful in getting that food ready and then handing it out to folks who come. I like that you said a New Year's resolution to kind of, you know, think of a way that we can put our needs aside and be selfless heading into the new year of 2022. What a great way to start. Jan, tell me your um, favorite part about being a part of Samaritan Ministries. What sort of joy does it bring you each day? I think that you see the joy as someone's life changes and it might just be that someone has been able to stay sober one day. Uh, it could be that someone's been sober for two years and has gone through our program and has a job and has their own apartment. It's just joyful to see their lives change. I had a cornerstone guest come back uh, this week and show me pictures of his Christmas lights at his house and that brought a lot of joy to my heart knowing that you know, two years ago, he was really at rock bottom and didn't know uh, what would happen next. And now he's experiencing the joy of this season. Wow. Thank you for sharing that story, Jan. Thank you for your service to our community and for joining us here on the local vibe. And I want to make sure that folks have the information for tomorrow so you can drop off your change in dollars at Truist Stadium in Winston-Salem beginning at 9 a.m. It'll go until noontime tomorrow. This is a drive through style event. For more information and other opportunities for you to donate, get involved and volunteer, we invite you to visit SamaritanForsyth.org.